ex-CIA chief John Brennan invokes Watergate, calls on Republican heroes to force Trump out of office by Christina Layla for the gatewaypundit.com. Former CIA director turned Twitter troll John Brennan fired off another ominous tweet to President Trump Tuesday. John Brennan predicted the outcome of special counsel Robert Mueller's probe would end up like the Watergate investigation with an impeachment and or resignation and called on Republican heroes to circle the wagons. John Brennan was heavily involved in uh, promoting Hillary's phony dossier and uh, once President Trump removed from office, the ex-CIA chief invoked Watergate and called on Republicans to circle the wagons and force Trump to resign after Mueller is finished with his investigation. Brennan tweeted, when the special counsel's work is done, the Republican Party must have its modern-day equivalents of Watergate heroes. Howard Baker, Elliot Richardson, Bill Rucklashaw's uh, John Dean, who will put country, fellow citizens, and lo the law above any one person, including Donald Trump. I say the uh, Republicans should circle the wagon and, uh, yes, put this traitor John Brennan in jail uh, and get him prosecuted. Uh, that's basically what I'm thinking. Yeah, where are the uh, Republicans to prosecute this uh, this uh, part of the witch hunt or witch hunter that he is? Yeah, this is un unacceptable. Uh, here's his tweet. When the special counsel's work is done, the Republican Party must have its modern-day equivalents of Watergate heroes. And he mentions all the names. Uh, who will put fellow citizens and laws uh, above uh, any one person, including Donald Trump. Yeah, I said they should get cracking and put you away, John Brennan. Yeah, it's uh, like long overdue for you to go in after all of this. Yeah, it's really long overdue. Uh, John Brennan previously, we know that, warned Trump over Mueller's investigation Stay tuned, because when Trump tweeted just out House Intelligence uh, Committee report released, no evidence that the Trump campaign colluded, coordinated, or conspired with Russia. Clinton campaign paid for opposition research obtained from Russia. Wow, a total witch hunt must end now. Totally agree with that statement, yes. A highly partisan, so Brennan uh, answers back to Donald Trump's tweet on April 27th. Uh, 2018, a highly partisan, incomplete, and deeply flawed report by Broken House Committee uh, means nothing. The special counsel's work is being carried out by professional investigators, not po uh, political staffers. Uh, special counsel's findings will be uh, comprehensive and authoritative. Stay tuned, Mr. Trump. So John Brennan was involved in this attempted coup, which is why he's lashing out on his Twitter account. In fact, Chairman Nunes is currently investigating whether John Brennan perjured himself in a public testimony about the dossier. You're still wondering if he perjured himself? Jeez. You're still wondering if this criminal perjured himself? Come on now. This guy should be in cuffs right now. Hold out in cuffs, not outside tweeting at this point in time. And I say get Robert Mueller also. Put him in cuffs too for his, his, uh, his, uh, uh, you know, what he did with the Uranium One and everything. Enough is enough already. I mean, this guy, I mean, you know, Okay, yeah, he. I, I get what you guys are saying, that he gets nervous, but, you know, at the same time, you know, you, you just get so aggravated when you read this trash from this, this piece of trash, John Brennan, this traitor to our country. Yeah, John Brennan. Meanwhile, 
he he's milking uh he's getting paid top dollar mind you all these years to destroy this country and destroy trying to destroy our duly elected president he should be hauled off to to prison that's where this guy belongs because uh, he's a traitor to this country, a, a treasonous behavior. I'd like to know the, the punishment for treason. You guys all know it. So, uh, I mean, I wouldn't go that far in my, you know, because I'm like a little bit, I'm a fighter, but not that much, you know. But uh, at least put him in where he belongs for a long stay over there along with his pal Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.